low-level nuclear waste that you can see stacked perilously here is normally put into a cooling pond until the radioactivity has been reduced to a level where it's deemed safe. And it's then pumped into the sea. Other processes sometimes take place to remove any ions that are deemed unsafe. Hopefully they do it more professionally than I just did it there. High-level nuclear waste, which can include fuel rods and such like from deep within the reactor core, are normally buried deep, deep down in a mountainside. Initially, the waste is turned to glass, and that's called vitrification, as you can see here. And then they're stored in big steel containers. Hopefully, they remain watertight so as not to allow rainwater to wash through, and they'll last for years.